Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler, and today we're playing Interstellar Rift. So today um, we have built the Behemoth at last, the Behemoth Freighter. You can see it here in front of um, our ship. Is this big um, freight ship we have in front? And yeah, this is um, to the right. We see the the deep space station and the deep space station basically I built it because I wanted to uh, make the the behemoth freighter here and uh, the reason was because uh, it, it uh, to build this ship it requires so much material that um, I couldn't hold it in my uh, private vault in um, the starter stations and yeah so I use the the deep space station like to gather all the resources this station has uh, four drone bays and the bro drone um, the drones some mining drones help me to mine the, um, the materials as well so we have now um, the mammoth uh, freighter um let's see where is it so with the mammoth freighter i um i uh, made the station no i don't see, maybe it's ah there i think you remember the mammoth freighter right is this other freighter that it's um is smaller than the behemoth you see it here with this one we built the the deep space station it's in the middle so to the right we have the the mammoth in the center we have the the deep space and to the left we have the behemoth so the mammoth i used it i built this ship to um create the deep space station and with the deep space station i um, built the behemoth so yeah and um, the thing is that this behemoth requires so much material that i couldn't just build it um, from a starter station and the other good thing is uh, that well now i've been making changes to the deep space station in such a way that i think uh, the mammoth if i wanted to salvage the deep space station the mammoth wouldn't be able to contain all the material but the behemoth can uh, so this is a good um, use for the behemoth but the other thing is and the main reason i wanted to build this uh, ship this um, the behemoth was to take uh, these um, hauling missions right these missions where you you are requested to carry a lot of uh, crates right like thousands of crates in in one ship so this um, ship has let's let's uh, look at it from another angle to get a better view of um, how it is arranged so you see here that this this ship um, contains uh, it has like these um, arms right it's um, the layout is uh, some sort of star and it has six arms right if you interpret it as a, as a star it has a, a six arms here and each, each in each arm it has um, a group of um, uh, of containers so it has uh, let's see it, it has uh, six containers maybe it's better if I if we just go there 
to the bridge I will show it So the behemoth, right? Behemoth freighter. We will, <coughs> we will teleport to this. Um, this um, because the the, the the ship is not. Um, it doesn't have much space inside in the interior. So we teleport here to this uh, room. Here we have. Um, the defense, this is the defense uh, part where we have the shields we have we have also the ship editor so we can salvage stuff with it okay so I'm lost now, where are we? uh huh, here ah yes, we have to go the other way And here you, you can see uh, where the, the containers are. These are large containers. And it has like these arms w uh, that hold the, the, the containers. And it has six of these arms. And I will go, this is the bridge. The bridge is not that big. But here you can see the, the arms. And I think if we go here, yes, I think this is a better view. And here you can see these arms, right? And in each one, it has uh, 11. In, in four of them, it has 11 arms, right? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> in each, in four of those arms, it has 11 containers, large containers. And in two of of the mid arms, the, these uh, two mid arms, then it has ten. So if we add up all the containers, in total there are sixty four containers, and each container can hold three hundred crates, and that sums up to nineteen thousand two hundred crates that this uh, ship can carry. So it's a lot of it's a lot of uh, cargo that I can um, transport with this um, with this ship and you see um, the reason I say that is not that big I, I mean the volume is is big and uh, the amount of cargo it can hold is big but I think it's not the, it doesn't have like so much of an interior space it has like this ring um, just behind the, the, the bridge where we have most of the system. Beside that, we have the cargo areas and the nacelles. And in the back there, you can see that I have um, some uh, salvage. Uh, there's the salvage unit and the disposal unit. So this is basically um, the layout of this ship. And I will show the interior. So here we have like this uh, defense uh, room and this life support where I have like the, the this um, thermal unit, thermal structure and uh, the life support there. And then uh, to the back we will have the cargo area so here is where the arms will um, you see the arms are coming out from this place here if we go to one of them You can see here the the 
the cargo uh, container um, interface and we have a um, cargo teleporter there's another one here and this um, relay cargo relay um, device and that's it also down there we have more of it you can see it here yeah so so in total we have um, 10 10 uh, cargo containers per per section right per arm per mid arm and then the the bottom ones are um, it has a slightly different layout but basically is the same thing yeah basically so it's um it's a pretty uniform um layout so it's not um we shouldn't get lost in this in this ship but it's 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 big right it's a lot of volume but i think it's not that um that complicated to to get around and the, the the central part is just like this large corridor that gives access to the different parts of the ship so here we have like the power boxes at the rear end and here we have the um, the nacelles these are the nacelles and in the top and bottom nacelles we have like the the big um big um, hydrogen tank i also use the the big batteries to power the ship because of course when you have um, a lot of cargo then you will need a lot of energy to keep the ship in warp right and you can see here that it's um, they are not filled <laughs> they're barely they have barely some power in them so i uh, um, put some um, fuel to to them but to one of the tanks but i'm afraid that this is not nearly enough i will have to uh, put m a lot more of uh, of fuel and this is the rear you can see the rear end of the of the ship so that's basically it it's not there's not much else to see basically the, the nacelles are more or less the same um there's a lot of um volume overall volume but not too much places i think to to go around that much and the bridge of course so here we have a good view well at the the bottom view of the of the deep space station so that's it that's the behemoth so i hope to uh, make um some missions with it at least one like um big haulage mission with it and i hope to um show you guys uh, what happens when i do these missions okay so that's it i hope you enjoy the video and hope to see you in the next one this is cyber settler signing off <laughs>